I tell you, that white boy can hit. You will not tolerate agitators' attempt to orchestrate a disturbance in this state. It is unacceptable that they use their power to keep us voiceless. Mm, from the critically acclaimed film Selma, actor Stefan James, who plays civil rights activist John Lewis, joins us. Good morning. Good to see Good morning. you. Good morning. Thank you. Welcome back. Toronto, Thank Thank born so and raised, you said this still feels like home. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Anywhere I go, Toronto's still number one. Even though you're so heart. big in Hollywood right now, congratulations on all your success. Thank you. Thank you so much. What an important and big movie, an amazing stellar cast to be a part of with this film. Yeah. Were you instantly aware that this would be an, a classic? No, you know, I don't think we, we knew what we were doing when we made the film, to be honest, and just how relevant it, it's, it, it is now and was at the time that it was being released. I don't mm -hmm. think we, we really imagined that, you know, it had the fact that it did, but we're happy that it did. <laughs> to think it's the 50th anniversary this year, yeah. right? We're talking 1965 when that march happened. Right. And the cast, like we mentioned, you just saw right there, David Oyelowo, uh, uh, Oprah Winfrey, Cuba mm -hmm. Gooding, Common. Mm -hmm. What was it like being amongst these people who I'm sure you grew up watching and admiring? Yeah, no, it was crazy. I mean, absolutely unbelievable for me to be around, you know, you know, such talent, you know, as a young actor, it's so valuable to me and, and was so helpful to me. How did this young boy from Toronto get the role? How did you get it? Were there a ton of people? No, it's funny. I actually, I put a self tape, you know, a tape and I sent it in to the casting and Oprah, you know, like 20 minutes later, I got a call like, Oprah wants to Skype you. Oh my God. And I was like, are you, are you kidding me right now? And yeah, it totally happened. It was very real. And what did she say? Uh, well, she had like tears in her eyes. It was, it was incredible. You know, she, she really told me that my audition touched her and that she would love for me to be a part of the film. So it all really happened really, really quickly. Did she give you any advice when you were there? What did you take from being near her and working with her? Oh, uh, well, you know, Oprah's like, <laughs> it's so funny everybody asked me what's Oprah like and she's just what she thinks she would be like you know yeah. just the most generous you know kind-hearted loving woman and you know to be able to have somebody like that produce the film and you know have that love and that energy sort of spread it really was infectious in the cast and in the crew and so everybody sort of really really got along and really gelled a true matriarch and then you have somebody like David who has to carry a film like yeah. this that's so powerful yeah what did you learn from working with him and he did of course get a ton of love during the awards season. absolutely shout out to David Oyelowo. David Oyelowo was such a brilliant, brilliant actor. To be a, a Nigerian, you know, born in London, mm. <laughs> and to come and play this American hero, I think is, and, and to do the job that he did with the role was just fantastic. So, you know, I, com I commend him completely and just, you know, I'm in awe watching him every day while we were working. And the soundtrack was equally amazing. Yeah. Common not only acting, but providing glory. Common which is, and John Legend, yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. and we saw, you know, during the Oscars, during the Grammys, the song was everywhere. Huge. So people who maybe didn't even see the movie were thinking, now I gotta go watch this. Absolutely. What do you think it is about a song like Glory that sticks to everybody? I don't know, you know, it's just like, when people hear a certain message, you know, and a, and a message that doesn't just connect with one group of people, you know, connects with a, a bunch of different people, and a bunch of different people can relate to the idea of glory and, you know, and, and fight and getting out of a certain, you know, sort of struggle. So I think a lot of people could connect with that, and that's why it uh, resonated with people really well. And of course, like we mentioned, you know, this was 50 years ago, and yet it still is so timely. They always say you have to remind it especially future generations, or else yeah. we may repeat the mistakes that we made in the past. Is that absolutely. what you're hoping people walk away with in screening oh, this? Oh, absolutely, absolutely. My greatest joy is seeing 12 and 13-year-old kids who come up to me and say, I saw Selma, and I learned something from it. Because as a 21-year-old kid, there was so much that I got to learn from the film. So I can only imagine what it's doing for the younger generation mm -hmm. and helping us to teach and, and not repeat the same mistakes. So it's great. And you have a great head on your shoulders. I see you're so humble and grateful. Thank you. What is next for you? I know you just wrapped up another film that we can expect to see next I did. year. I did. I'm playing uh, Jesse Owens, Olympic runner Jesse Owens in race. Huge. That comes out next year, 2016. Uh, right before the Olympics. How did you physically prepare for that role? It was a lot of running, a lot, a lot of running. <laughs> and like bye bye to pizza and pasta. Oh and yeah, I had to just yeah, X that out and uh, a lot of running, a lot of training, but it, it was worth it. Looking forward to it. And of course, <laughs> you can watch Selma at home, everybody. It is available on the Blu ray combo pack May 5th. I think that's Tuesday. That's coming soon. Yes, that oh, is. Oh, yeah, May 1st is already Friday. Exactly. Yay! <laughs> SelmaMovie.com. Sorry, I got really excited about that. Yeah, thank I know you. in LA you're used to this warm weather, but you remember. 
remember what our cold winters are like, right? I do, I do. I don't want to remember, but I do. <laughs> <laughs> and shout out to your brother who's here today. Yeah, He's shout going, out Shamir. Shamir, come here. Shamir, you guys are both going to be in race together in 2016. The yes. bros yes. are in a movie together. Yes, yes, we are. Because yes, I said, are. aren't you proud of your brother? And he's like, I'm proud of you because you're both doing your due in Hollywood. Yes, yeah. we are. But you still feel like Canadians, right? Always, Deep down? always. We're always. nicer, right? <laughs> Very oh. nice. <laughs> I don't want to make anybody upset. See them both next year and pick up Selma. Thank you so much, Thank guys. Thank you so Continue much. Success. I appreciate it. So A much. pleasure. Thank you. Right now, over to Jen at Live.